So you do pick up a little bit of a tap. And then the toes, this is what I call the flag part position. Oh, right, right, right. You hold on to the bar as long as you can with the second hand. Then you look under your arm exactly like the blind change. You look down under your arm and you'll see the low bar. And you should catch it with good posture. I can't emphasize that enough. If you arch your lower back even a little bit, you can destroy your gymnast. So I can tell you, conditioning, 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 and being very careful, spotting them and preparation. Do not rush the skill. It's easy in one summer, from the beginning of summer, say starting about June 5th, 6th, till about August 30th, I had at least six kids that started doing the blind change from scratch and the overshoot, and they could do blind change to overshoot at least to a good support, like a 45 degree angle, some of them to a handstand, and they did that one summer. The, the dot on the bottom where the wrist is is the base of support. The hip is about where the center of gravity is, and all of that has to be stacked up on top. That's very essential to doing this correct, okay? So the breakdown, that's the part where they're starting to break down the key.